The memory appears to be fragmented. How much time has passed? A few months, I think. That virus is cutting off our access to complete memories. The readable, the messy. The Seven Years' War will soon break out in the colonies. Focus on assassin interference. We'll do our best. Won't we, numbskull? So grim about the homestead now that Miss Abigail and little Connor have passed. Hi. I've seen Achilles crying. Why shouldn't he? It's just that he doesn't look sad. He looks furious. Alive. We are Loaded, Captain! Fire! up! Use the sticks! Serve us off the wind! Loose and catch the wind! I know, but it's been months, and we've done little but search for this blasted manuscript and box. Le Chasseur has a lead on the box, to meet him and Chevalier in St. John's. Chevalier too? No hope of cheering me up, then. When Achilles said whoever had the artifacts could access sites of great power, what did he mean? I'm not sure I understand it myself, Shay. I had a long talk with that Wally about that. He believes the box can be activated to... Well, project words or images. Like a magic lantern. What do you mean? You know the magic lantern shows Father Connolly put on in the church basement? The box had a candle in it, I think. He put these little glass plates in front. Then we'd see the images projected on the wall like cathedrals in Rome. Bright and near as big as life. Ah, yeah. I suppose it is, except that it interprets the strange language of the manuscript, too. If the plate were of a banner in Latin, we'd see it in English. How is that possible? Who knows? I fear we might never truly understand how any of the pieces of Eden work. Where in the world has the most beautiful girls? I suppose it depends on your vision of beauty. A damsel from Corfu would work from Oslo where as different as chalk and cheese, but both can be lovely. See, opinions like that give a man a reputation for wisdom. Yeah, thank you. I would have just said the banner. The girls there have lusty buttocks and bosoms and feel no shame in putting them on display. But that's no slight against our lasses from home. We're almost there, Captain. The Chasseur will be expecting us. And Chevalier. That's a small price to pay for a lead in the precursor box. Chevalier, what happened to your vessel? I got myself into a bit of a scrape. Sent three ship in all hand to their watery grave. The Giafoon nearly followed them down. Just your fate has been better, Le Chasseur. Indeed. My sources inform me that Samuel Smith has searched far and wide, looking for answers on how to make that strange box work. He just returned from Europe. Where is he now? Refitting his schooner. If you hurry. You can catch him... there. Oh, remember those blueprints? Well, I had an engineer build that marvelous weapon for your ship. 
Master Buckles gun fires more shots than an artillery brigade, and twice as fast. Many thanks. Anything for my wounded friends. Captain, the I will join you on this voyage. Then shall we, gentlemen? You are in a jovial mood, she? Why shouldn't I be? I have a new weapon, and we'll soon have a chance to use it. Besides, Templars are usually well guarded, and I'm sure that Smith fellow is no exception. I also took the liberty of ordering some improvements. Morgan now has a ram cut through ice itself. I have heard of such technology, but never witnessed its operation. What about Smith, then? Is he close by? Aye. He sails his very waters. And he may have the precursor box. There he is! Most fortunate timing! Lady Luck never ceases to smile on you. He's seen us! Give chase! But hold your fire! We must not damage the box or risk losing it to the sea. Can this bucket go any faster? At least my ship is still seaworthy, Chevalier. Samuel Smith is the Templar's treasurer. What he's doing in these waters is beyond me. Maybe he came here to meet someone, or ran into your pirates. He's refitting his ship. So something must have happened. If one of my allies attacked him, I would have known about it. Well, he's back from a long voyage. Now's our chance to get him. Smith controls most of the Templar's wealth, doesn't he? With him out of the way... Washington entrusted the precursor box to him. He probably still has it. Shay's right. The box comes first. So we can't sink him. We'll have to board his ship, or force him to beach. Let us hope ours bears just as well. We can't risk losing the precursor box, Captain. Careful, you simple man. But destroy the box. Fire! Damn it! It worked. The way is clear. Now, uh, once more, your fortune wins. But do not waste time congratulating yourself. Smith is giving away. It's an ambush! How will you see Diablo not there? Smith must not escape! I don't see Smith's ship! Let's get rid of these distractions first. We'll find him. Smith, he's moving again. Hold 
doubt he hoped to be a spectator of your demise. I'm glad to disappoint him. And he's still within reach. God. Game, cabbage farmer. Ships of the Royal Navy, sir. Just that ship, what Captain. wickedness is this? Another Templar tactic. They can cover whole stretches of ocean with their flames. Careful, Shay. We could be burnt to cinders. It's nothing more than a last desperate throw of the dice. He knows we have him. Precursor box, Captain! Careful, you simpleton! But destroy the box! Fire! This is not a game, cabbage farmer! Can't risk losing the precursor box, Captain! Now we know where he was headed. Parson has an ink tappet here. Follow him on land. Do not even think of firing the ship's weapons near that precious box! I'll take care of this.
What you're doing. Kill him! Somebody stop him! What are you time. waiting for? Finish him now! Kill him! Somebody! You will regret this! Think about what you're doing, assassin! Your brotherhood is using you! Regret this. <clears throat> this cannot be. <clears throat> no. Do you even know what that is? An ancient artifact. Treasure from those who came before. Yes. It matters not. <clears throat> Some of the greatest scientific minds of all Europe could not. Make it work. <laughs> now all I need is the manuscript, and all shall be revealed. <laughs> 